guys, me Ryan here with uh, another review. This time on the 7654 Droids Battle Pack review. Um, it's a Droid Battle Pack. Um, this is a review of it. Haha, <laughs> very funny. All right, it has 102 pieces. It's ages 6 to 12. That's what it says on the box. Uh, came out in 2007. It was 9.99 at the time. Now worth about $25 if it's sealed brand new. Start you off with the box. Alright, build your own army. Uh, I really love these build your own army things on them. They look pretty cool. I wish they would re release this battle pack. I love it. Uh, it's a 30th anniversary. On the back shows the figures. And the new, the other new 2007 sets, but it's 2010, so almost 2011. So, yeah. Not really new there. Alright, I'll start you off with the minifigures. Let's get in there. Let's get down close. Okay. So, it comes with four battle droids. This was before they had the new arms on the battle droids. Uh, that didn't come out for an, until June that year. So, you have four battle droids that look just like this. Uh, nothing new. And three brand new Super Battle Droids. At the time, they were brand new and really cool. That's why I got seven of these battle packs when they were released. Um, really cool. Uh, they're just like the blue ones, I believe. They just have the silver, grayish color. So, whatever. I think they're better. I don't know. Three of those, which is really good. 102 pieces for 10 bucks. That's less than 10 cents per piece, but just barely. And, um, if you think about it, they resemble each other, these two. The new one and the old one. Whatever. I guess. I don't know. That's just my opinion. You can have yours. Okay. So, let's get started. On here, in here, there are two studs here. Hold on, let me get this off. There are two studs. Studs in there. You can see it now. And you just place the droid on the two studs. Pretty simple, right? And there's the guns for the other battle droids. You place a battle droid there. And a battle droid. It's hard to do this with one hand. And, of course, it's my left hand that I'm doing it with. So then, hold on, I'm trying to reconnect this. You're going to want to uh, take the supers, three supers. You can do it however you want. This is the way they showed it on the box all the time, so this is how I do it. Put one there, and obviously do the same for the rest. So I'll just go ahead and put it on to show you the looks. It looks really cool with them on. You can customize this set a lot into a bigger carrier if you get more than one. Um, it's really good for customizing. And then you got one lone battle droid. What's gonna happen to him? Oh yeah, there's a speeder. What now? Yeah, and it comes with a really cool, at the time, brand new Stap speeder. They haven't reproduced it in any other set, so it's exclusive uh, to the set. And that is really good. The Stap. It's a really nice Stap. I like it a lot. And um, basically, you take the battle droid, flick his arms out, and uh, Connect them to the handle, like so. They use lightsabers for guns, lightsaber um, handle things for guns. These are guns, or boosters, I think. These are the guns. These are boosters. I don't know. Whatever. Hold on. What are the lightsabers? Okay, and really all this does is turns a little bit, and these go up and down. That's it. It's a it's a battle pack, so what do you expect? But for the first battle packs, they were probably the best battle packs. Value. Well, the first clone battle pack wasn't a good value, but it had really good clones, so it was good. And then the instructions uh, shows you how to build these supers. <coughs> yeah, this is the old way Lego shop at home used to look. I like it. I like the old one. Then it shows this, which... This was the actually the only battle packs that actually made sense that fight each other. Because, like, 
all the other ones, like the, <clears throat> well, the Rebel and the Stormtrooper, but then after that, Clone and Assassins, no. 2010, oh, 2010 made sense, and then 2011, again, no sense at all. So, you know, it just depends. We're at 3 out of 5, that makes sense, and yeah. Okay, well, I want to thank you guys for watching. Please, um, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, great set. Recommend you pick it up if you don't have one. Just one would be good, because they're pretty expensive nowadays. Uh, because unfortunately, you didn't pick them up when they were $10. Suckers. Okay, so I definitely recommend getting one, and, uh, yeah, so, bye.